Today we're going to cut to tutorial for Canon 7D. Um, first, you grab the battery and uh. Go. Hey, what are you doing? <laughs> Hello and welcome everyone. After that rocky start, allow me to demonstrate how the Canon 7D camera works. First, you insert the battery and power the camera on. Make sure you set the left side dial to M for manual and insert the compact flash media card. But, take great care as the internal pins are very delicate. Next, enter menu mode, locate and activate the clear all camera settings function. Also, do the same for the format function. This will erase all previous recordings and user settings, leaving the camera ready for you to personalise with full memory available. Then enter the menu mode once again, locate and select the file name function, then select change user setting 1. Now, press the erase button to erase the existing file name and locate the selection button to write your new file name. Finally. Press the menu button to confirm this name. Now, in menu mode, locate and select movie record size, then locate and select the option 1920 by 1080 25 fps to set your aspect ratio and frames per second. Then use menu mode to locate and select video system to enable PAL, then locate the ISO button and set to 800 ISO. Though, in exceptional circumstances, other ISO rates can be used for varying lighting conditions. Now, using the main dial on top of the camera, set the shutter speed to 50, but be careful you don't change the shutter speed during shooting. Check the rear LSD display regularly to make sure you are shooting at 1 50th of a second. Now, Locate and select the WB or white balance button, and use the quick control dial to enable Kelvin mode. You can then use the main dial to set your desired colour temperature, which will change based on the lighting of your location. Roughly speaking, you'll want 5600 for outdoor daylight, and 3200 for interiors with tungsten lights. And that's how you set up the camera Canon 7D. Now, to set up the sound kit, first grab the shotgun mic and attach it to the gun grip. Then, put on the weather sleeve noise dampener before plugging the shorter XLR cable into the mic. Next, set up the mixer by inserting batteries, powering it on and ensuring the channel 1 and 2 faders are all the way down. Confirm that the appropriate switches are on the line setting and plug in your headphones. Make sure that the blue return light is off, then press the tone button to confirm the audio setup has been done correctly. Finally, connect the rifle mic to channel 1, put on your headphones, slowly fade channel 1 up, and listen for audio. Now, to use the task cam, hold the power button to turn on. To access the settings and controls, press the menu button and use the main dial to scroll through the various options. To record, press the record button once to see the audio levels, and again to actually start recording. To pause recording, press the button once, and to stop recording, when the record button is flashing having been paused, press the stop button. Finally, to connect the task cam to the mixer, connect the red and green microphone cables to input 1 and 2. Then, use your headphones to listen to any audio that is recorded giving you the ability to correct any problems during recording. Well, that's everything folks. That's how to set up all the equipment and use it. Thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for watching. Yo Adrian, we did it!